So here's a clever trick in Maya. Here is how to use the infinity curves with offset technique. And I've done a little walk cycle here with Monty, and you can see that I've actually animated Monty physically across the screen. So it's a 32 frame cycle where 32 or frame 1 and 33 are the same. Um, but I'm, instead of animating the um, walk on the spot as on an imaginary treadmill, I've animated Monty across the screen. Now, you might think that you can't infinitely loop this cycle, but actually you can. So if I take the shot length up to frame 99, so now I've got my, um, uh, I've, I've got my shot, so go from 1 to 33, um, and what I can do, I'm just going to get the shot back to the way it was when I first animated it. If I if I press play on this, this Monty isn't going anywhere, right? He's just walking along and the animation stops at frame 32, or rather frame 33, and nothing happens. So if we want Monty to keep going, what we do is drag select all of Monty's curves and then go turn on your infinity curves, which are down here. So I'm just going to rip, tear this off so you can see it. Um, so turn on infinity there, and then we need to turn on and drag select these guys are post infinity curves but with offset so this is the crucial bit so you want to go post infinity cycle with offset and now Monty will keep going up to 99 frames so even though we've only done one walk cycle we can have Monty walking indefinitely and then we can go ahead and bake our curves um, and then adjust them individually so that is how to use the infinity curves with offset.